Hello everybody, welcome back for more Blasphemous 2. We have got four of the doves now. We just finished off the Severed Tower. <clears throat> We've now got all of our traversal abilities. And another spot has opened up by the uh, Choir of Thorns. The village that was reflected on the pond disappeared, and it leads into the two moons. So we'll be going there to find out what's up that way, but as I already mentioned, uh, we kind of gained all of our traversal. So all of those gold things that were around, we can get rid of that too. Um, you know, they are all accessible to us. So before we go that way, we're going to do one final backtrack and get everything we can. Starting with one that I actually found that I know I didn't get, which was actually fairly sneaky, uh, but I found it actually while I was doing my off stream while traveling around during work. So we're actually going to start by going here, and we can actually get the part that I haven't gotten in here as well, so that's good. So as it turns out, there is a baby up here. But not only is there a baby, they repeated the same Easter egg from the first Blasphemous, just a little bit differently. We have a portrait room. Now, I actually don't know most of these. Um, if anyone does know them, feel free to let me know in the comments on YouTube or any of that. But, uh, I don't know. Like, the red sword there is probably the giveaway for that. I don't know what the pixel one back there is or the woman with the teddy bear. I've seen that character model, but I don't know what it's for. The only one I actually know is, like, that is totally one of the alternate skins from Dead Cells. And then these three, that might, is that, like, that's not, no, no, it's not. So I'm not sure what any of those are, except for the Dead Cells one. But, cool that they stuck that in there again. But, yeah, that ain't, that baby there was the one thing I'd already come back here to do so but there is a gold point right there so let's go get it hey all right and I can just go all the way down yeah I don't think so buddy you can get wrecked See how this works. There we go. take that one off. There's pretty much everything there. There's one there. May as well. Actually, I'm feeling super lazy. 
So. care of this first and then I think I'm actually going to go back this way. I think we also need the 12,500 for the last sister. Oh right and there, you know what got that, got that got those. We may as well just take the long way So we can uh, change that back to something more fun. First off, what is up here? What's that good for? Oh, I know what that's good for. Huh. Taranto to my sister. Ah, okay. Now we're, we're switching up to that one. Because that's another favorite from the original. Chant the storms sung by the broken voice of a legionnaire. Yes, 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 okay. I'm just going to stop using these swords. Okay. Oh, wow. That's another 110 XP. Do I have, like, the Perfect Traveler set on? Yes. Yes, I do. There's still a number of rosaries in there. again that and what is that exactly oh right 3500 tears of atonement is what we would have gotten had we not been trapped by this thing Sure. You still nothing? Okay. Got 
still got this. Got three of these wax things now. Actually, no. We'll, we'll do the challenge first. Ahoy, Mr. Drew! You've got me backtracking. As we finally have the ability to go everywhere. And we have a final... Another dungeon opened up to get the fifth and final dove. Which we'll be doing after the backtracking. Depending on how quick the backtracking goes. Because I do have a friend showing up uh, kind of soonish. But for now, we found our fourth ch our fourth sister. Or fourth daughter. Que so let's do this. La campana. Boom. Y nos hundiremos en un mar de luto. All right, let's do this. Deuce. I don't think so. That was, that was an intense fight, but Ruego Al Alba saw us right through. And an ornate chalice for our troubles. Do you say anything different now that four of your daughters are there? El velatorio no está preparado aún, penitente. No. Nope. Encontrad a mis hijas y apagad sus cirios. Well, that was a nice little spot of backtrackery, and hey, we have enough for that sister. But since I'm right here, I want to take care of these first, and we'll drop off the... Uh, chalice and pick up the sister on the way back and then i think we're gonna go back to the severed tower clear out that because there is a bit of that map that i missed because uh 
I went down to fight the boss instead of going up. I went down and down led to the boss. So I still have to kind of join the tower at the two points that we've entered it from. Oh. But yes, I like having the ability to grab those now. Uh-huh. A uh, fourth wax seed. So we're gonna have to find where these go eventually. Oh, fuck it. We may as well just get this one, too. Fool! <laughs> nothing in these areas there's just the one thing there so you may as well just like do these there we go Upgrades the boosted mystical damage added during the blood pact. I have nine marks? Jesus, God. Halves the cost of the Reaper Rosary. And also, Endless Flame, Explosive Embers, Soul Combustion. And then this has so much more to go. Um... And it costs 10 to add the final altarpiece. You know what? I feel like maxing these out is better than the altarpiece for a start. So let's finish off Ruego. And let's begin finishing off uh, Veredicto. Yeah. Hmm. I see how that works. here a sealed envelope letter found in a room in the street of wakes it exudes a dark aura of danger dear anonymous reader if thou readest these lines it is because thine curiosity has suppressed thine will thou hast dared to open this sealed letter thus committing a grave crime and illegitimately taking possession of that which it contains, which is none other than my curse. Thine is, now as, thy, 
as thine had been the sin. With these words inscribed in black ink, I curse thee to follow in my footsteps, the same footsteps of another sinner I followed, and another, and another, and another, thus perpetuating the curse. The first step of the one who seeks redemption lies in performing an act of humility for this. Thou must seek out the largest looking glass, prostrate thyself before thine reflection, Look thyself in thine eye and beg forgiveness. Where have I seen a large mirror, then? I wonder if that... Is that cursed letter page one? Is that, like, secret ending hype right there? Is that, like, multiple ending hype? Like, we, if we do that quest, we find something we can do to do a different ending. Because I know the first one had... Well, the first one had the two endings. And then the third one added with the DLC. Which, of course, as we've already discussed, this game goes off the ending that was brought in from the Wounds of Eventide. But... Who knows? Maybe they brought that back. I've been keeping myself as blind as humanly possible on this game, so I'm not sure if they've uh, added in multiple endings again, or if there's just one this time. It wouldn't. It would actually surprise me if there was only one. That's how you do it. A fervent kiss. Excellent. Oh, now I'm torn. Oh, we got that. We can get rid of that. I mean, we can get the last... This is how much I care about Sarmiento and Centella. I would rather get the last sister thing first than get that effigy for my altar piece. I mean, really, I think this speaks for itself about how much I really kind of care about Sarmiento and Centella as far as the weapons in this game go. It's fun, but it's nowhere near as badass as either of these. Final Fervent Kiss, is this going to unlock the door? Because we're getting near the end. Sentí como vuestro fervor exuda por cada fisura de vuestro metal y regocijaos. Penitente mío, os continuaré asistiendo si me entregáis vuestros besos. Entregadme vuestros besos. There must be more then. The door is still locked. Alright.
First things first, we're getting this out of the way. Actually, what it would be smarter to start from the other side. Just remembered what the map layout was. Five percent, twenty nine bibbies. I can get rid of that question mark now, too. It was intentional for them to put an upside down cross in the center of the city. sangre no deja de manar. Vuestro cuerpo no admite más de ella. Ah, okay. So we are maxed out on health pickups. Doesn't say we're maxed out on vials or potency, though. And there's still places to search. And at least one whole new area if not two that we still have to explore. Oh, right. Sisters. This last time we came here, we... They were ready for us. We just didn't have the money. But now we have the money. Tributo? Para honrar. Kobe had the mayor. What did that do exactly? Give me two more marks martyrdom from combat. Okay. And then we can just take those two rat skulls off because they, they won't be necessary. Is it an effigy? One and three more. Okay. Oh, and company is arriving. So.
Kohibata Mare automatically regenerates health. What? Go now, my sisters. Let the miracle lead you to the darkest corners of this forsaken land, as only in there will you find the greatest secrets. I feel like I need it. Equipped. Do you say anything else? A vuestro servicio estoy, penitente. No. Okay. El milagro os guarde, penitente. Well, we are gonna set ourselves up for the final round of backtracking. gonna get this first because it's right there get everything off the map that I can real quick get to the save point I want, we'll end this stream there. We want to start here. Actually, now nah, we can start there. That makes the most sense. Then we'll go down there, down there, in there, and then we can jump up to here and here. Because, yeah, we can jump up through, warp over to here, get these done, go through the tower, drop off babies, take care of these, and then we're right where we need to be. So that is how we will take care of it next time. Thank you, Mr. Drew, for joining us today. And I hope you have a good evening, and Ms. Jenny too, and we will see y'all next stream.